Thought one, shame on you if you missed Saturday's game against Memphis. Not only did you miss an opportunity to watch the possible first quarterback taken in next year's NFL draft in Paxton Lynch, but you also missed easily one of the best games of the year and a game that will be remembered in the American Athletic Conference for years to come. Houston was down 20-0 at one point and trailed 34-14 in the fourth quarter before rallying and preserving their perfect season. It was an absolutely electric atmosphere with record attendance that included J.J. Watt, DeAndre Hopkins, Roger Clemens, and Houston's own Bun B. If you missed out, I feel sorry for you. Thought two. Last Saturday's MVP was easily Kyle Postman. So let's get this straight. Greg Ward Jr. receives a Heisman letter earlier in the week, making him a candidate for college football's top prestigious award. Then, rolls his ankle with a little bit of time left in the first half, and you insert Kyle Postman. When Postman entered the game, the Cougars were down 20-0 and had only produced 49 yards in five possessions. The former walk-on then completed 21 of 33 passes for 236 yards and a touchdown. He also ran in the game running touchdown in the final possession. Postman played with confidence and was the number one reason that the Cougar season is still alive. Thought three, this Saturday's matchup with UConn is an absolute trap game for the Cougars. For one, Houston is coming off of a physical, emotional, hard-fought victory against Memphis. For two, next week the Cougars will close out the season against Navy for what should be the AAC West division title. The winner will likely play the conference championship game against Temple. For three, UConn is five and five with nothing left to play for but spoiling someone else's season and has been preparing for the Cougars for two weeks coming off of a bye week. Also, the Cougars are 13th in the AP poll and generating plenty of buzz not only in the conference but nationally. They are the hunted now, so when teams prepare for them, they're going to prepare to make a statement. The Cougars need to be cognizant of that. Follow us on social media and visit us at CougTV.com for more content.